Hello guys, it's your boy Dumanji, and today I'm here with another tutorial. I know I did one a long time ago, but it was really unnecessary. So this one is actually going to be able to help you guys, especially if you guys are wondering how to use... Well, you saw it in the title, but I'm just going to announce it again. Haptic feedback on a PS5 controller on PC. Because as of right now, Steam is working to support this um, PS5 controller, but not every game is optimized for the PS5 controller on PC. So in order to get haptic feedback on the PS5 controller to work in general, you have to go over to a couple of settings and make sure that everything is fine. Now the first thing that you want to do is make sure that your main playback device is your PS5 controller. And in order to do that, just go over to the sound little icon at the bottom and go over to set playback device. And then you just select the wireless controller which is most likely going to be your PS5 controller. Now, after that, make sure that you go over to your sound options. There's not many steps to this, but just make sure that you follow. So go over to sound settings. When you're in sound options, navigate over to device properties. And then when you're in device properties, go over to additional device properties. And then when you're here, just navigate over to the tab enhancements. When you're here, just enable speaker fill. That's all you gotta do. Apply and OK. You can just test this out by playing a couple of songs or whatnot on your computer. And your PS5 controller should be able to um, replicate at least the sound. And also another thing that's pretty cool is that if you put your ear up to the controller, you can hear the sounds coming through the controller as if it's just a speaker. Um, but yeah. Well, that's really it for this video. I hope that this video was helpful for you, and um, without any further ado, peace, bro.